Well, it's a way for Hawaii students to honor our veterans. The city and county of Honolulu is once again holding its So Alay for Memorial Day poster contest, and it's inviting kids and teens to send in a poster paying tribute to our military members. Joining me now to talk more about it are Jeannie Ishikawa, Deputy Director for the Department of Parks and Recreation, and Tyrell Futialo, the winner of last year's contest in the 9th through 12th grade division. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Good Thank morning. You. So first of all, Jeannie, what is this poster contest about and how does it all tie into Memorial Day? So Memorial Day is a city-sponsored event that has been going on since the National Memorial Cemetery, the Pacific Punch Bowl, has opened, was opened in 1949. So ever since it opened up, we have had um, this poster contest mm -hmm. to encourage the, the donation of lei for Memorial Day. Okay, and then the contest is open to... Hawaii students yes, and the deadline is next month. Yes, so it's open statewide mm -hmm. for all students whether you go to public school, private school, charter school or homeschooled. Any student between kindergarten and 12th grade can enter the poster contest. The deadline to submit the posters to the Department of Parks and Recreation is March 2nd. Okay, and what are you looking for in a poster contest? What do you want them to think about when they're submitting their uh, um, entry and drawing? We think this is a great opportunity for teachers, parents to to um, enable the children, the students, to express their thanks and mahalo to all our veterans, whether living or deceased, for the sacrifices they did for our country and for the freedoms and rights that we have today. Okay, and Tyrell, you're a junior at yes. Arlington High School. <laughs> you won last year. I know we have a picture of your uh, drawing, but I guess when you were drawing it, what was going through your mind? What was your inspiration? Um, my inspiration was really just incorporating the title into my artwork and, you know, just finding an appreciation for what I'm doing this for and everything like that. And when you found out that you had won that division, what did you think? Um, I really didn't believe it. Um, <laughs> yeah, but I worked really hard for this, and yeah. Yeah. All right, and that's, that's the winning entry. Look at that. And how long did it take you to draw that? Um, I believe a month or so. A month? Yeah. <laughs> wow. And for students or even parents watching, thinking, wow, maybe my student can win as well. They like to draw, they want to become an architect mm -hmm. or a graphic designer, and they see that. What message do you want to give to them? Like, don't be intimidated, take your time. What's your yeah. advice? Um, I advise that you just, um, just find the goal and just go for it. Like, just go all out for it, and then don't think like a second place. Don't just think mm -hmm. with your heart. Draw yes. with your heart. And I got to say, I was one of the judges last year. Yes. Um, I, w I am going to be another judge this year. And I got to tell you, we received a lot of entries. Yes. It was difficult there with the other two judges. <laughs> I'm holding your drawing. There you go. Yeah. But it was really difficult. I mean, there are some very talented students out there. And there we are. That's how many entries. Yeah. Just part of what we received, because right. I remember going through each division and age group and trying to pick, and it is not easy. It's not, it's yeah. It's not. So final words, Jeannie, for anyone watching who would like to submit and participate? I think, um, as Tara says, is, is draw with your heart and draw with mahalo um, in your thoughts, whether it's a lei that you draw, whether it's a, a child sewing a lei, any concept of so lay for Memorial Day that will encourage the donation of lay for Memorial Day. Okay, and then the deadline is March 2nd. And for more information on how to submit? They can call our Department of Parks and Recreation. Um, our phone number is 768-3003. Or you can always email us at dpr at honolulu.gov. All right. Or well, parks at honolulu.gov, I should say. Okay, and we still have some time to submit. And yes. look forward to judging more this year. Thank yes. you for being here, Jeannie. Thank you. Tyrell, congratulations Thank from you last so much. year. <laughs> Mom's here, too. She was very nervous, but he yeah. did good, right, Mom? No need to be nervous. Yes, she, you got her approval. Thank you. <laughs>